Guardian boys and girls. We got the intro. Huh? I'll use that as the intro. Okay, so y'all heard it from, from the missus. We're going to be talking about the outbreak perfected here. Now this is strictly from a PvP, PC point of view. I'm sure this gun might be different on console. I'm sure, like, you know the metal's, the meta's different. Like, uh, I'm pretty sure you guys use pulse rifles a lot more than we do. Uh, I don't do PvE points. So if you like to tickle Callus's nuts with the little Siva swarms, you know, that's that's cool. I like to tickle Guardian nuts with the Siva swarms. And that's me. <laughs> So for pulse rifles, I don't really use pulse rifles that often because of my aim style. I'm much more of a flicker versus <laughs> versus <laughs> versus tracking, which is why I don't use auto rifles either. Although I can definitely tell my gameplay, my tracking has gotten better since back in the day when I first started PC. But yeah, primarily I, I prefer hand cannon shots where it's like one nice big damage hand can shot with you know a few milliseconds in between each shot to readjust and your aim that's why i like hand cannons now when i look at a gun or use a gun i think about like well will will this gun replace my ace of spades will it replace my last word is it is it that good and the short answer for this gun is no this gun is good but it's not like great. It's pretty on par with other pulse rifles. Um, the exotic perk might come in handy a bit more in PVE, but in PVP, the little nanites I've only noticed have like maybe helped me with like five kills, if that. For me, honestly, I would I would much rather use uh, my bygones, which has outlaw and kill clip, and that one that one melts people pretty good. And I've actually use that in PvP um, quite a bit when I'm messing around, but I still wouldn't really use it in competitive settings because I need to be able to compete with um, hand cannons. So where this gun's gonna shine, of course, is in your longer, your longer, uh, your ranges, like on Meltdown from A, capture point A to capture point C, ranges like that. For my loadout playstyle, like, I usually have, if I'm running a hand cannon, I'm usually gonna run like a sniper with it. So I, I have my hand cannon for close to medium long range, close to medium range, and then my sniper for medium to long. This gun is good at long ranges, but with the way Destiny is, there isn't any range that you can't close, basically. There's always something, you can, you can manipulate the map to get yourself closer to the enemy, to use whatever you want. Like you can basically play entire rounds or entire matches with just a shotgun and do do just fine. That's why there's nothing really special for me about using a pulse rifle. And I can if I can't reach him with my hand cannon, I can just you know work the map and get closer. That's my general standpoint in this gun. It's a decently balanced gun. I'm still out there looking for a gun that can replace my beloved hand cannons and do what I'm doing with the ace in this rumble match right here. I don't need to make a 10 minute video explaining this pulse rifle. A few minutes does it. Yeah, okay, bye. Okay, bye, man. Bye!